today's question is to find the nth series and term of the series so we have a uh, series of p that is arithmetic progression and we have to find the nth term of the series and initially the two terms or you can say the two num numbers are given of the series that is a and b so let's see the concept first what is the concept of api and uh, let's see now so yes so as we know a series is in api if the common difference of the two term let's say two four six eight so common difference of every two term will be same so the here the common difference is two here two two so this series in so this series in api right so there is a formula for finding the nth term of uh, series of api so let's say the nth term formula and the term formula is a plus n minus 1 d this n is the nth term that we are going to find out and this a is the first term of the series and this, this d is the common difference so a is the first term first term f term d is the common difference c difference and n is the nth term right so let's see uh, the example first so it's a, here the example is given here the example is given the two terms are given 2 3 the first term first and second term of the series is 2 and 3 and we have to find the fourth term of the series so let's see the solution first so the first term of the series is 2 second term is 3 and so on and we have to find the fourth term so our n is 4 a that is the first term is 2 and common difference d is 3 minus 2 that is 1 so to find the fourth term t of 4 fourth term is equals to a plus n minus 1 that is 4 minus 1 into d d is 1 right so it's 2 plus 4 minus 1 3 into 1 so it is over 5 so 5 is the answer here as you can see now the second term is the uh, second series is given 1 2 and so on and we have to find 10th term so t tan is equals to a that is the first term a plus 10th term we have to find n minus 1 into d d is the 2 minus 1 1 so it's 1 plus 9 so answer is 10 so as you can see 10 is the output so let's see the code part now. okay so it is first i'm raising it and yes now the code part so initially i'm taking a and b as the input and also the term let's say k for the term now I'm taking the input from users a, b, and k. So we know the formula and we know the first term. So let's see the common difference in d is equals to b minus a, b minus a, right? So just we can do that with a c out that is a plus n minus 1 cross d or in place of d we can directly do b minus b minus a right. so just remove and at the end you can do the end of the line right so let's compile it first so i'm checking that we are getting the these outputs or not and constraints are also right so here n was not declared so oh sorry we have to k as an n right so let's compile now so constraints are right and we so 5 and we are getting 1 as an output because here it's 1 and 1 so let's submit to check where we are passing or not the old test cases 
let's see yes code is accepted so we have completed the question of this ip series so the next question is to find the nth term of the gp series so let's see the concept of gp first okay so as we know this uh, in gp series let's say this is a series like 2 4 8 16 32 so common ratio should be same like the common ratio of 4 by 2 is 2 8 by 4 is 2 16 by 8 is 2 32 by 16 so common ratio is same it means the series in gp right so it's a gp series or you can say 4 16 64 and so on so common ratio is 16 by 4 4 4 is the common ratio and here also the 4 is the common ratio that is 64 by 16 is equals to 16 by 4 right so common ratio is same so this is why that is why the series in gp so the to find the nth term of a gp let's say tn is the nth term of a gp the formula is a into r to the power n minus 1 this is the formula for finding the nth term of the gp so let's see the example here that they have already given to us so example is 2 and 3 is the series series variables right and uh, yes and we have to find the first term not the first term let's see what they have given as input first line of the t for the test cases first line contains two integers a and b first two terms of the gp second line every test case it contains contains of an integer n in each separate line print the nth term of the gp series right so this is the gp series they have given 2 comma 3 uh, let's select the yes okay so they have given the series 2 comma 3 right and uh, the first term is 2 r is the common ratio 3 by 2 and we have to take the floor as they have already mentioned here you have to take the floor of 2 and 3 here so 3 by 2 is 1 point something and its floor will be the lower value right so it's 1 point something and its floor 1.5 its floor will be 1 so common difference or you can say common ratio is 1 right and n is here we have to find let's see what term we have to find we have to find the first term here right first term. so let's do r equals to so n equals to 1 right so t1 is equals to a2 into r is 1 to the power n first term 1 minus 1 right so it's 2 cross 1 to the power 0 and it's 2 1 to the power 0 is 1 so 2 cross 1 is 2 so answer is 2 and yes you can see the output is 2 right now move on to the next next example they have given the series 1 2 so series is 1 comma 2 comma so on first term is 1 right r is the common ratio that is 2 by 1 that is 2 and we have to find the second term right as you can see the second term we have to find right so t2 we have to find the formula is a into r to the power n minus 1 so what is a 1 what is r 2 2 to the power which term we have to find second term so 2 minus 1 so it's 1 cross 2 to the power 1 that is so answer will be 2 so yes we are, we can see the output is 2 right so now let's see the code part right so i am taking 2 integers a comma b as an input also n for 
the and the term that we have to find out right now we can do c out a into r to the power n minus 1 so we have inbuilt in build for um, function for finding the power r comma n minus 1 so it's a cross r to the power n minus 1 right and what is r so we have to find firstly the r r equals to b by 2 so we have to take the sorry b by a so we have to take the floor of it. so just do this floor of this ring and end of the line here so let's compile it first to check we are getting the these outputs or not for these inputs so let's see first so it is ready for evaluation and uh, yes our output is right 2 is 2 2, two, uh, two and 2 right so let's submit it and we are submitting the code for the further test cases and uh, we are failing here so congratulations let's see the error here so error is let's see input is 84 87 and 3 third term we have to find its correct output is 30 and your output is 84 so let's see with the formula so what we are getting here right so we have the first term that is a is equals to 84 and r is 87 by 84 that is one point something let's say 2 0 2 so its floor will be 1 right so r is 1 and we have to find the third term that is n equals to 3 so we know the formula uh, t3 will be a that is 84 cross r that is r 1 to the power n minus 1 that is 3 minus 1. so overall it will be 84 right so our our answer is correct but they are saying the tent says 90 so i think they have taken the ap so let's solve it by ap so first term is 84 plus n minus 1 2 into d common difference is 3 yes 3 across 2 6 84 plus 6 9 but it's a dp so there is no mistake in this code they are taking it as a ap but as we know we are solving series in gp so there's uh, some problem in this interface but overall our code is correct right so our code is correct so that's all in this video see you bye bye